Hey guys, what's going on? Gamer here, and welcome back to a series you guys know and love, Overwatch. So last episode, we were playing as McCree. Started again, going from left to right, we were playing as McCree, and now we are playing as Farah. 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 I think. Yeah. Anyways, uh, she's an interesting character because when I first started to play Overwatch, she was actually one of the first characters I picked up um, and to play. And uh, I really enjoy her because she's very mobile, agile, she's in the air, and a lot of the times it's really hard to hit her. Um, if you're kind of one of those, like, you know, if you shoot it by threes or, you know, whatever. Even with an automatic gun, it's kind of hard to hit Farah. As you can see, someone else on the team is also playing. So if we're doing a quick breakdown on the character, left click does just shoots rockets because, you know, who doesn't love rockets? Right click basically makes you fly, but you can just, and if you hold it, you fly, like a jetpack. But you can just hold space bar for that. Um, shift, it'll shoot you really high up, uh, just quickly, really high up, and then has to recharge. And then I won't use the E quite yet, because I'll show it off a little bit later when we get into some fights. But, um, that's pretty much what Far is, uh, and her ultimate is really cool. I won't talk about it until I actually get it, because it just seems, it makes more sense that way. So we are attacking, and we are going to be moving the payload. I'm going to go down there to help her. Uh, this diva, uh, because the, the diva can't just be by herself. That's just there's no point. The diva's supposed to tank. Five, four, All right, here we go. Three, two, one. All right, so this is from the backside. So basically, what basically what you want to do is you kind of just want to go. What? I was not expecting her to be there. All right, so let's not do that. We got to... Someone's got to focus that... Uh, what's it called? Uh, that sniper, the Widowmaker, because that's that's not good. She can she can one-hit kill me. I don't, actually, how much damage does the Widowmaker's thing do? All right. So... <laughs> okay. All right, and basically what my E will do is if I do that, it'll just push them in a direction. Okay, got a kill. All right, the team's over here now. Okay, basically what you want to do as the tactics that you want to have with... Uh, um, with Farah is a lot of the time you constantly want to keep on the move and just you want to hit rockets because you have to always remember that the rockets do have splash damage on them so okay Bastion chill out uh, you gotta remember that the uh, rockets do have splash damage on them so you can actually um, work uh, on the splash damage so you want to shoot in the direction of people because if it hits them directly, it'll do a lot of damage. But if it hits next to them, it'll still do damage, I'm pretty sure at least. Um, and if you shoot yourself up in the air, people are not going to expect that you're going to do that. So it's a lot harder to, you know, if you just randomly shoot up, it's harder for people to kind of know where you are. Um, another thing is that if you're getting, if, you're, if, if the enemies are too close together, you want to use your E to try to split them up. You don't want to have, you don't want to fight too many enemies together. But then again, ah, it's so annoying. Okay. That Widowmaker is good. I, that's, that Widowmaker I can say is definitely really, really good. Ooh, high noon time. All right. So. Yeah, again, like, that, there's an issue. It's like, you either want to get the uh, teammates... Uh, okay, hold on. And this is pretty much what I do, is I just spam it. Alright, got a kill. And there you can see splash damage. There you go. Again, splash damage, and of course... You know, paying attention to where they're walking to then shoot ahead. Because you gotta forget, you gotta remember that the what's it called is going. The uh, the rockets are not gonna move as fast as the uh, as the people. So you gotta. Okay. Uh, let me go up. Are you kidding me? That was like inhuman rea- Oh, because it's that it's the uh, it's Torbjorn's thing. Dang it! Dang, flabbing it. Alright. 
Alright, someone get the payload, payload, payload. Someone get the payload moving. So I do need to show off my Q. Um, I do want to find the best time to use it, but I'll show it off pretty quickly. Um, Come on! Can I get a heal? God! Where is this team? Oh, I just realized why we're... Yeah, where the heck is... Yeah, Lucio, where are you? We need you. Okay, let's go. That was actually a good spot to use my Q, too. I just didn't have the health to use it. Because I didn't want to use it and then die. Because I think... I actually, I think if you're in the middle of your alt and then you die, I think it only goes down to 50% rather than... All the way down to zero. There's Bastion. I'm this is the alt where I just shoot a bunch of uh, rockets. And as you can see, I got a double kill there. Um, and if actually, if this uh, Lucio on the enemy team used uh, his alt literally a few seconds earlier, I wouldn't have killed anybody. But that's the alt. You shoot a barrage of uh, missiles uh, raining down on people, and it's crazy. It's really powerful. Um, now what you want to do with that is you always constantly want to have a group of people That's like as you saw the best time to use it is when there's a group of people together clustered You can just do damage all together at the same time All right All right, wow, I never knew you could actually get up here Dang it, I was about to press left shift to go up in the air I love this guy who plays this guy team rocket, which is really funny because that's a Pokemon reference, but uh, he only plays snipers. He's played so far Widowmaker and Hanzo, two snipers. But the only thing is I wouldn't really consider Hanzo a sniper per se. Um, and I'll talk about that more when we get to him um, in the series. So the series, as of right now, as of the time I'm recording this, it's only going to have 20, uh, 21 episodes because there's only 21 characters in the game. But as soon as more characters are introduced, and I know there are because they've already announced more characters coming, um, well, I'll definitely do more videos on it too, or on those characters. Okay. Let me just back it up, reload, and yeah. Okay, so now, okay, I want to back off. All right, got a double kill before uh, dying. That was actually a really good alt. Normally, anything more than uh, two kills plus is already a good for is good for an alt. Uh, but the thing with that alt is that it's really easy if people can aim properly. It's really easy to kill you because you're just kind of. Uh, well, you're just sitting in the air. You're not moving whatsoever. But either way, we're, it looks like we're about to win. We have a four minutes to escorted so much. All right, I think we're about to win. Can he deflect rockets? All right, there you go. All right, and we win. There we go. First game down, uh, and we're going to get into a second game. Show off a little bit more of uh, Farah's skills. Or my skills of Farah. Where am I? Oh, yeah, I'm on the bottom right because I have a skin for her. I forgot. Ooh, the Torbjorn got to play the game. I love that skin. I gotta say, that's an amazing skin. Oh, yeah, okay. He char he supercharged it to level 3. And there's my ult. And then, let's see. He can pick up two? I know. He can pick up as many as he needs. Jeez, man. 8% armor uptime. 10 mecha deaths. Jeez, man. That's insane. That's just... She's called 7 mechas. That's impressive. That's actually really impressive. Alright, let's see the stats for the game. Any any greens? Wow, a lot of greens. I used to play Farah a lot. That's why I'm surprised. 16 kills. Uh, 8 deaths. Not bad. Uh, is that a... That's a 2, right? 2 KD? A 2.0, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's 2.0. All right, so that's kind of my my thing of like it's really hard to go negative, but I mean it is possible. We saw in the last episode, in the last game, I went negative because I just couldn't get any kills and I wasn't really being useful. But yeah, no, it's okay. 
It's okay if you go negative. I'm, it's not like Call of Duty where your KD is the biggest issue. Uh, where is she? Oh, yeah. We were already on her. All right. So, yeah. I do have a skin on her. I don't think this is a legendary skin. I don't actually remember if she's a legendary if this is a legendary skin for her, but I don't remember. Um, here's a more here's a lookout again of the skills and everything that she has. But uh, yeah, all right. So let's try to win this game again. I'd like two wins back to back uh, with the character that I do know how to play. Characters I don't know how to play, I won't go such uh, like uh, such in depth uh, talk on them. But since I do know how to play uh, Farah I, or Farah, whatever her name is. Uh, I, I still don't know how to pronounce her name, but um, since I do know how to play her a lot more than I do know how to play other characters, I'll like characters I know how to play well. I'll do an in-depth talk uh, of my play style and how I see other people play it. Oh, I never knew that there was that statue over there. I never actually took the time to look around. That's pretty cool. This map is uh, interesting. I don't really like it per se, but uh, it's it's an interesting map. I never knew, like, I sometimes I just don't take the time to look around these maps. Not that I have ever have the time. Soldier 76, reporting for duty. Soldier 76. Alright team, anytime you would like to come in and help, clearly you don't want to come and help. I don't know why I did that. I don't... Uh, Okay, they also have a far on their team, which actually killed me. Yeah, we don't have a support. Oh, no, we do. We have a Symmetra, but Symmetra is good when there's a lot like in a lot of enclosed spaces or like places that they have to go through like tunnels and stuff. Other than that, I don't know how I mean, she has like the, her alt that does the uh... actually. Why am I talking about this? I'll talk about this later in the in the episodes that she's. Oh yeah, uh, also I, I forgot to mention about Farah, is that you can actually use that, that thing. Uh, how far can that thing travel? He was like across the map. Oh no, he was actually really close. Oh, I was literally on the edge of it. So the thing I wanted to mention is that if you use your E uh, near yourself, you also get flown away. So it's actually possible, like, yeah, you can use it as an escape or as a push, you know, one of those things. All right, you're dead. We will rally to your position. All right. <laughs> Ouch. I never knew you can do damage to yourself. I, I feel like that's new. How? Oh my God, he was so low. Look at his health. Bottom left, look at the bottom left, let's see how much health. He had four health! Four! Oh my god, alright. Let's take the teleporter. Alright. Not the best spot. What's the point of that? Alright, he's dead. You're dead. <laughs> the guy just fell into the hole. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that was uh, Junkrat's rip tire. Pass into the iris. All right, I need to use her ult. I didn't get a kill, but I did a lot of damage to their tank, which is what I was trying to do. Even though I probably shouldn't have done that. I think that's the point of a tank, to soak up damage. So I probably shouldn't have done that. Well, live and learn. Kind of the whole point. Uh, uh, yeah, we won the last objective, right? The last control point. Did we win that one or did they do that? Oh, wait, no. This is a, this is a new game. This is the first one, isn't it? Ah, I don't remember anymore. Okay, well, we'll see. Dang it. I was about to kill him, too. I was reloading. Darn it. Darns it. Uh, yeah, I was about to kill, or I was about to hit him, which I don't know would have killed him or not. 
Either way, we're about we're really really close to winning or to getting this uh, this round at least. Um. Okay. Yeah, we still. I love how the team comp didn't change at all since uh, since we started. Trying to break the shield. Uh, trying to break the tank shield. Yeah, okay, that was only the first round, so I got one more round to go. This might be a little bit longer of an of a episode, but it's okay. It's okay. Alright. Let's see, what do we have? Same team comp, two Soldier 76s, uh, Bastion, Winston, Symmetra, and Far. That's actually a relatively balanced team. That's actually really balanced. Oh, alright. Okay, let's go. Let's, uh, let's do this. Oh, yeah, you can put sprays down. I forgot. I need to show that each time. I forgot about that. The sprays that I like for my characters. I can just do this the whole time, but that's boring. Okay, let's not do that. Okay. Oh wow, okay. Get over here. Okay. Let's grab it again, because we still need to grab it, and then back right off, because I knew that was gonna happen. Dang it, Symmetric doesn't do enough damage fast enough. Nope, never mind. Symmetric wasn't even there and that hit me directly on. Darns it, darns it all. Okay, let's go. Let's get back into the action. Uh, okay, team comp still the same. I feel like they're switch. I feel like if you keep switching, it kind of disrupts the momentum or like the like the thing. I think you need to stay a character a little while to like really get things going. Yeah, I hit her. I hit their Farah. Okay. Dang it! Ah, oh, they had no, 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 no. Is it not as old? It makes them invincible. Experience tranquility. I love his voice, or its voice, because it's a robot. Why is uh, okay? Whatever. We lost the objective, but we got forty-two percent, which actually isn't that bad. I thought we got a lot, uh, a lot less. So. I got the discord orb on me so I gotta be careful because that doubles the damage or deals more damage to me when they hit okay good time to go up break a shield break a shield good 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 Right. Tactical visor's up, which is nice because uh, that means he can't miss his shots. All right, we got it. Uh, let me heal up a little bit. Okay, never mind. Maybe I won't heal up. Let's see. Is there, I wonder where they're going to come from. Well, I mean, they're going to come from over there, but like, yeah, they could just go around or they, yeah, there's one guy coming through there. I just love doing this to scare people off. Right. <laughs> oh man, it's so funny to sneak over them, like when they don't have the, where they uh, places where they don't have their shields. All right, eight damage. Good, good, good. Did the team quit? I feel like people quit. <laughs> um, where'd they go? Seriously, I feel like some of them just don't. Wow, I couldn't even get a single point of damage on before Bastion killed him. That's how fast he kills people, like squishy characters at least. I mean, honestly, to be fair, even characters that do a lot of damage i mean have a lot of health he also kills pretty quickly anyways this is boring Justice reigns from above. 
I had to use it. The thing is running low. Dang it, she hit me. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have used it. I thought we were about to win that. I guess not. Oh man, the, it, it scares me only because like you're like, nope, you can't come back from 99%. Oh, trust me. I've seen it happen. And I've experienced it. Okay, I killed him. Reload! Help! Team! What are you doing? <laughs> oh, okay. That's okay. Um, oh no, 80%. That's bad. Come on, come on, come on. I really don't want to go into a third round. This is going to be an incredibly long episode. Yes, we won. There we go. Alright. There you go. There I am in the bottom right, kneeling down. Ooh. It was probably when... No? When was it? I'm curious. Oh, it was on the first round. Okay. She killed me. Or it killed me. Killed him. Then got another kill? No, almost got another kill. That's pretty cool. Ooh, 32% of rockets fired and direct hits. 45 of them. That's, yeah, that's impressive. Me being a Zenata player as well, that's actually really impressive. Uh, this, uh, the transcending, uh, the transcending heal, not the total heal. Um, alright. That's not bad. Objective kills leveled up. And I guess just before we finish off, I'll open up a loot box that I got for leveling up. Let's hope we... Hello? Alright, let's hope we can get something good. And... Ooh, purple! Ooh, Torbjorn. <laughs> All right, that's actually pretty cool. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that episode of Overwatch uh, sh uh, showcasing Farah, And I've actually learned a couple things as well as, you know, showed her off and played her. So next time we're going to be playing a different character. And yeah, stay tuned. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed the series. Comment if you want to comment. I don't know. Um, what's your favorite Farah skin, I guess? And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out. See you later. Have a great day, guys.